In this video, we're going to cover the way the contact sheets are made in Adobe CS4. They've changed it quite a bit since CS3 and actually made it a lot simpler. The first thing you need to do is create a folder on your desktop like we have right over here. I've named mine Buno Contact Sheet and in that I have placed all of the photos that I want to use to make my contact sheet up with. This is going to be for the 20 and for the 6. So that's a, a really good idea is to have this all made up because it will make it a lot easier when you go to make your contact sheet. Then we're going to go down here in the dock and find the bridge. The contact sheets are now made out of the bridge. So click on the bridge to bring it up and then go to your desktop and click on Buno contact sheet or your contact sheet. Now if your desktop, your bridge doesn't look like this, <clears throat> then come over to Window, Workspace, Reset the standard workspace, and that will make it look just like I have it here. Then come over to the green button, click on that, and that expands the window. Now, <clears throat> from here, the contact sheet is located under Output. So click over on Output, select PDF, and then under Template, select for the first one, the 4x5 contact sheet. That sets everything up for you. Click Auto Spacing. Rotate for best fit. Now, in order to make our contact sheet, we have to select the photos that we want. Since we've already put in our folder the 20 we want to use, we just come down here and click Command A. That selects all the photos. Then click over here and have View PDF after Save so you can see what it looks like. And click Save. It brings you up the Save As dialog box. Make sure that you put your name and the assignment it's for, and this one is for portrait. So I know what the contact sheet is for. Make sure in portrait assignment one, and make sure you do this so I know what it looks like. Then hit save. And then a few seconds, it'll come up, and we have our contact sheet all done for us. Now that's to do the 20. To do the six, we deselect everything, just click anywhere and we select the six photos that we want one two three four five six those are the six photos you can select them either all in, in a row or you can command click or control click on the PC and select individual ones come over here to our columns and for this we want a two by three two columns by three rows everything else remains the same all we do is come and say save, give it a title, just like that. Click save, and in a few seconds it'll generate our contact sheet. And there's our contact sheet all finished. There it is. So that's all there is to making a contact sheet in CS4. Remember, your best bet is to make a folder with all your uh, photos in it that you want to make a contact sheet and put that on your desktop.